welcome back to another Tech Team GB video. This video will be looking at the poor man's iFinity setup. Right, so we have three completely different displays. This one's a TV uh, that runs at maximum resolution of 1920 by 1080p. Uh, this is a proper monitor, it's a BenQ LED monitor. Uh, this runs at also 1920 by 1080p. And this is a smaller 15 inch monitor that runs at 1280 by no, 1024 by 768. Uh, so we're pairing them together uh, using the AMD Catalyst control signal and the Infinity um, support in that. Uh, so as you can see, uh, the screen's quite pixelated, the icons are quite big, but we've been checking out some games just to see how it performs. I'm not actually keeping my desk set up like this, uh, it's just a little thing that I was bored and I decided to make a video on it, so here we go, we'll check out a game, what game do we choose first, uh, we'll do Left 4 Dead 2, next we'll play this game, well, we'll see how it performs, yeah, it's just not much else. Okay, I'll probably have to set up set up in the game. You have to change the resolution to the resolution of both monitors. Now Steam has stopped. It's not running whilst on Steam in order for this to work. Steam is running. My computer just seems to be being a bit of a knob at the moment. One second. Let me try running that again. I think the game's getting a bit confused with the resolution, but we'll see if we can get it to run. If not, we'll check out a different game. I've had a few games running on here. Uh, it looks quite good actually in the game. Okay, that, that doesn't seem to be working that game. Uh, we'll be trying. What else can we try? Saint Row. I've had this game just running now, so this should definitely work. Just get the start. I'll use the controller so I can get out of the way of the monitors just so you can see how well it's working. Move this headset off here as well. Right. I'm using cheats at the moment, by the way. <laughs> just loading. I would check out some Battlefield 3, but that game takes ages to load up. You have to go through the browser, it's just pathetic. Uh, so we won't be checking that out, just because we can't be asked. Go through that. You can see my system running down here if you're interested. Let's go to the garage. I'll let you check out the settings so you can see. Just get that. Um, See how the game's running. Okay, let's just go to options, display. Okay, so we're running at a weird resolution because we're running something called bezel correction. Uh, so we're running at 3072 by 768. Uh, full screen mode, we'll see. Uh, set to high, which is 4 times MSAA, 4 times anisotropic filtering, and direct tenet. And we're running VSync. So just play around in this for a minute. See all the monitors performing well. Uh, I recorded the average frame rate earlier and it was about 35 40 FPS, which isn't too bad. Um, if you're wondering, the graphics card is a HD 6950, 2GB uh, version. You need at least 2GB to run an iFinity setup or anything over 2516 by 1600 you really need 2GB just because the amount of textures it takes up uh, hopefully you can see this, it's running nicely and smoothly get out, just do a bit of stupid stuff like you do on this game punch a piece off so it falls there you go, as you do stamp on someone Get some guns out. Let's 
Get the guys at the in by oh, crap, I just kept him instead. Okay, so that's Saint Brew. Just down there. Uh, um, what we got? What other games can we play? Play Formula One 2011. That that one takes care of Ifini quite well. Racing games are normally the best for Ifini, uh, simply because. It's quite useful because you can see what's coming next to you, so if there's a car coming for the side you, you can actually see it on the monitor. See that's the load. Why is my computer being a total not answer? I mean does it want to play? Crisis 2, that should work. Need for speed. I might have haven't played that yet. Let's just see if we can play Crisis again. Never played Crisis 2 in Arsenity before, so we'll see how it performs. Some games just aren't compatible with Arsenity straight out of the box, so that's why some of them don't load up, because they can't handle the resolution. The dimensions of these displays, this one's a 24 inch, this one's a 22 inch, and that one's a 15 inch. So you can see the screen's a bit, or well, the height's different on all of them. That's why I put these ones on the books and DVDs just to boost it up a little higher. Seems to be running okay. Okay, we'll just play a bit of campaign. On these campaigns. I don't really play Crisis 2 and Campaign. I more play online. Sorry, it's taken so long to load. I didn't really plan what games I was actually going to play, but never mind. I've started now. Submarine, cool. This gives you a good idea about how well Crosses 2 works with iFinity. I did used to have free 1080p monitors for iFinity, and but I didn't see the point in running it because my graphics card wasn't really powerful enough to run three 1920 by 1080 monitors because it comes out at a weird resolution like 5960. And you need about a three or about two, three year cards to power that sort of one up. This actually looks really good, surprisingly. This video is going to end up being a lot longer than I planned, but oh well. you can just skip loading scenes if you can't be really bothered to watch them. Just 
walk around with it. You can see if these things are still on. Yeah, oh, I'm not even running at the full resolution. 3132, that must be best reflection on the stream settings. That looks even better. Seems to be getting tear in here. I thought I put V Sync on, so I don't know why that's happening. So where I've got to go. Oh, I want to break my neck. There we go. A bit of swimming. Da, 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 da. Hey, that's enough for Crisis 2. Uh, any other games we can play? Great Battlefront, I think. Let's see if enough here to. Uh, actually, I don't think I've even started campaign on that yet. Because I just recently reset my computer, so. looks like stretched to the three screens. That's the only reason why I would never really have my affinity set up because you can't just have a screen maximised on the one single screen. <laughs> hey, anyway, thanks for checking out this Tech Team GB video of Poor Man's Affinity Setup. Uh, be sure to comment, rate and subscribe. Uh, yeah, thanks for watching guys. Bye.